Today we're going to take a look at this $99 drill from Amazon. It comes with a half inch all metal keyless chuck, a 4 amp hour battery, a charger, a carrying bag, a set of drill bits, and a set of driving bits. Did I mention it's $99? We're going to put it through its paces. We're going to drive and remove 50 3 inch by 3 8 lag bolts. And we're going to drill a bunch of inch and a half spade bit holes into a doubled up 2x4. And we're going to see, does this thing swing above its weight class? And is it worth the $99 from Amazon? <laughs> Today, I've got the DCK drill. This is on Amazon for $99 US right at the moment. This was sent to me free to review. You guys know I take that kind of stuff as long as they're okay with me taking as long as I need and if I can be 100% honest with my review. So I started doing some digging on this guy. I want to give you the specs on it first. It's got a 4.7 star rating out of 132 reviews right now on Amazon. So what do you get in the box? Well, you get the handy dandy throwaway carrying drill bag, which I don't know, some people use them. You get the charger, you get a four amp hour battery, you get the drill with the all metal keyless half inch chuck, you get a set of drill bits, sorry, driver bits, and a set of drill bits. Now, it's just any old $99 generic drill. So I started doing some digging to find out a little bit more about this company. And I got to share something I came across with for you. I ended up reading an article over on wrenchesandrides.com. And they talked about this DCK company. It turns out they're an OEM and an ODM supplier. So that's an original equipment manufacturer and an original design manufacturer. So this drill here for $99, there's a really good chance that there's a bunch of clones made in the exact same factory that look and function the exact same way but have bigger name brands on them than we might necessarily think. Now we're not necessarily talking about the big three but a step down from that these guys supply a lot of those different companies and I thought that was pretty cool. The world experience with this guy was over at the daycare that we're renovating for my wife. It's an old church. We needed to drill for a dryer vent through the outside of the house, the building. Four and five sixteenths, I believe, was the size with a hole saw. Said, well, what better way than to do this? So through drywall, through sheathing, through clapboard, and through vinyl siding. And this thing had more than enough power to do it. Never felt underpowered. As a matter of fact, it grabbed my wrist two or three times and just went whoom like that. So the thing is rather torquey. Now I've been doing a lot of driving lately, but not a lot of drilling. So I thought, hey, what better way to test this out, to put it through its paces, than to drive a whole bunch of lag bolts and to drill a bunch of inch and a half holes straight through a doubled up 2 by 4 So let's get started and see, just so you can see, there's four LEDs, full battery. So we're going to check its temperature before we start and check its temperature at the end to see if I accidentally killed it like I did with my DeWalt. So I didn't hit record for the first eight bolts guys. I got nine in here so you can see I'm going to back them all out, put them all in again and then we'll check how much uh, battery life's left. It's got good torque, I'll give it that.
Oh. Split the tube before. That one must have hit a knot. Okay, so we've got, took us about five minutes to drive and remove 23 eighths by three inch leg. One bar on the drill. And right now we're reading 74 degrees Fahrenheit. So now we're gonna take this guy out and we're gonna put in the drill killer. All right, here goes. Let's see if I can get 20 holes drilled here as quick as possible. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Eight. Fudge. Fuck. Starting to heat up, guys. Number 10, here goes. Definitely heating up. All right, so 10 inch and a half holes through a doubled up two by four with a speed demon bit. Let's see how it ends up. A hundred, 107 degrees Fahrenheit is the hottest I can get. So there it is. Now, how much juice do we have left? Two. Not bad guys, not bad at all. Let's go back over to the big bench and we'll see where we end up. First off, <laughs> what did I think? Well, I don't know if you can tell, but that thing has some torque. <laughs> Every time I had to hold it up against my body so it wouldn't grab the old wrist and just want to go whoop, like that. So does it have torque? Hell yeah, it has torque. On setting one on drill, no problem at all. That thing went through the wood. Now, was it as fast as a DeWalt? Maybe not quite as much. Did it have a little more power than the uh, plastic chuck that I burn up? Yeah, it really does. That thing, I mean, now, Who's this for? The average homeowner, you know, a workshop guy, a handyman who does just a little bit of work, a young fella who's just getting started? Absolutely. $99 for a four amp hour battery and a half inch keyless chuck. It's still warm, but it held up. Who is going to be using this for drilling 11 inch and a half through what, three inch material holes back to back to back to back? or 20 lag bolts, boom, 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 boom. You're gonna give it a break. So 20 lag bolts, you could have went with about, you could have dro drove about 80 with this, or you could have drilled about 40 holes with the one battery. Now, what's the downside? 
one battery. That's what it comes with. The charger doesn't hold the battery as well as I would like. It doesn't lock in. I want to show you if I can here. It's just kind of weird. So you just push it in there like that. It will slide out. It never feels like it's quite in place. The charger feels small. But, you know, whatever. What do you think? Uh, comes with a, an assortment of, you know, drill bits that are dollar store-ish. <laughs> I don't know. We could test them out. I'm not going to. I don't ever judge a drill by the throw-in accessories it gets with it. This is a cool little kit, but it's tiny. I wouldn't want to use it with this drill. I'll stick with my, you know, spade bits and that sort of thing. So, what do I like? It has plenty of power, has really good run time for what it has. Didn't overheat on me any more than any other drill I've used. Downside, one battery, charger is dinky. Is it worth $99? Yeah, it is. What I think is pretty cool, if you go to dcktool.com, just peruse their offerings, you will see stuff on there that looks very, very similar to a lot of the other stuff you see out there right now. So, first off, like I said, this was sent to me. So I wanted to use it, have time to actually test this thing out and see, hey, what the hell, is it actually worth it? And for 99 bucks, yeah, it is. This is gonna be my go-to drill for the next little while because I burn up my DeWalt and my wife got me a nice one for Christmas, but it's a heavy duty hammer drill. So right now, <laughs> this is actually the only straight up drill I have. Now I don't use a drill a lot, so it's not gonna be the end of the world. As far as interconnectivity or compatibility with batteries, they're just a little bit different than a lot of the other ones. As far as compatibility goes, I keep Bauer and DeWalt batteries around here. Neither fit this. So it looks to me like it has its own little proprietary connection on the bottom and it is what it is. Now, as far as DCK, uh, in the US, they have a decent supply or a decent uh, assortment of tools on Amazon, but overseas apparently in Great Britain and places like that, they have a full lineup, including outdoor gear and that kind of stuff. So hopefully we'll get, uh, I love having middle of the road or low end options to pick from. So hopefully someday we'll get a full lineup of DCK tools that the prospective homeowners or you know the the up and coming handyman can start with so i hope you enjoyed my review of that guys i enjoyed it i, I love getting things in the mail it's fun i remember when i first started my youtube channel i thought it'll be cool someday when companies are willing to send me some stuff as long as i'm okay with or as long as they're okay with me being honest and open and taking my time with the reviews the link for this product will be in the description below if you're interested, pick one up. If not, that's cool too. Like I said, it's for a very specific type of person. And if you fit that bill, then maybe it'll work for you. Other than that, guys, keep tuning into the workshop. We got generator reviews. We got DeWalt gear. We got all kinds of head-to-head -head stuff. I hope you enjoy it. And as always, stay happy, stay healthy, and have a great week.